Hey guys, how's it going? You ready for another update on the P-Series system? And yes! This time we will bring you guys a couple of new features with this new firmware and I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to miss any of them. Uh, anyway, let's take a look. So first of all, we're going to support call Note on this P-Series system with the new firmware and uh, you might want to try this. This feature truly helps. You can set up the call disposition in advance and next to time when you try to handle these phone calls, well, there you go. You can use the call disposition to mark each one of them. Very user friendly, very convenient. You shall give it a try on your Linkus. All right. And the second one, I believe this is highly demanded. It's going to be the CRM template. Uh, that feature is going to be supported with this new firmware for sure. So think about it. If you're using some other CRMs, some local brands or in-house CRMs, you want to make the integration works on the P-Series system. Uh, well, previously, you know, we can do the API integration, but this time, what if I tell you we can use the template with the easier way? That sounds better, right? So there you go. You can actually try the CRM template feature. Uh, we can support lots of customizations there. You can customize your CRM information, for example, like uh, the logo, uh, the name. Anyway, you're gonna customize everything there. Make your job way much easier. Besides, for something existing on the PCR system, we also have a little bit of optimizations there. So for existing CRMs, uh, pretty sure you will have a different experience this time. For some features like incoming call pop-up, contact synchronization, call journal synchronizations, I believe you will have a quite different experience there, which is better. So don't forget to give it a try. This is about the CRM template uh, integration solution. And uh, number three, keep going. Number three is going to be LDAP. This solution is quite similar like what we had before, uh, which is going to be the Microsoft SQL. It's quite similar. So if you're using some other third-party LDAP for the context management, well, it will be synchronized on your PBX as well. Good solution. Don't forget to give it a try there. And the other one is going to be the Microsoft Teams. For this one, to be more precise, it's not going to be a new feature, I guess. This is kind of like uh, we give you guys some, uh, let's see, updates there for helping you get a better user experience, especially for the presence synchronization. So this time when you use Microsoft Teams integration with our system, you can actually check on your P-Series system. You can set up the role, how you're going to synchronize the presence. Uh, it can be one-way synchronization. It can also be both ways. Uh, fully customizable. Don't miss it. Give it a try. All right. Let's so anyway, that was all we have with this new feature, with this new firmware. All these new updates are going to be available on the P-Series system very soon. Don't forget to give it a check there. Uh, let us know your feedback. All right, I'll catch you guys in the next one.